mean, Steve, frankly, put it in one word, is amazing. Probably I would say uh, enthusiastic, creative, uh, and incredibly hardworking. He was, uh, and still is, very much his own person. Uh, I think quite, uh, quite self-confident, uh, talks quite a lot, but heart very much in the right place. My name is Julie Clayton, I'm currently the head here at Delamere Academy, uh, and I know Steve, I've known Steve for a very long time. Uh, Steve has always been my boss, so I first met Steve I think was in 2007, um, when I applied for a part-time maternity leave here at Delamere Academy. Well, I got to, to know Steve through, through Delamere, and my wife became a governor, and Steve was became the head. The school was threatened with closure. In fact, it was on a list. The Cheshire County Council were going to close Delamere. I offered to uh, give the school a bursary, but then a few months later, the chairman of the governors got a job elsewhere in Yorkshire, and Alex turned to me and said, you're going to have to do that too. And that's really where I met Steve. So I said, look, look, Steve, 41 pupils, we've got nothing to le le lose here. Uh, take that computer off your, off your desk. Forget about the school improvement partner and do it your way. Three years later, the school was full. And suddenly I realized there was no stopping Steve. Uh, he then applied to be in an academy, which he could do with, because he just had an outstanding Ofsted inspection. Whatever he does, he's always got the best interest of the children at heart, regardless of whether it's as a class teacher in his class originally, or as a head teacher, and now obviously as a CEO, it's always been that main focus on how can we improve their children's lives and, and give them a great opportunity and a great education. What I've learned, especially as I've taken over as head teacher, is that it's important to take some, some risks sometimes, and you know you have to take those opportunities and those chances. I feel very proud to have been part of his story. And I'm so pleased that what was a difficult situation when we met has turned into a complete triumph. Action, take 54. Sorry, didn't see you there. Been a bit silly this morning. But across Grosvenor Park Academy and the Trust, we have been learning about such amazing novels and mature things that help bring our brains to life, such as King Kong. Action. I'm Abigail. And I'm Kiara. Our, our favourite things are... Sports and music. Uh, I'm Abigail. Let me take turns. Action. Take 47. Hello, tonight is the news. Psych! Today I'm going to be talking about the Year 5 Residential. We've been doing bushcraft skills such as canoeing and rock climbing, lighting a fire and more. Today we're going to be talking about maths at Grosvenor Park Academy. The ch challenging questions helps us solve tricky questions with big numbers. Sometimes when we get really stuck, the tractors can come in handy. Action! Take 103. Hello, who are you? I'm Charlotte. I am... Oh, no, can we start that again? Yeah. Oh, we have a go. Action. Take 103. Hello, who are you? I'm Charlotte, a.k.a. Mrs Gill, and I'm in charge of my class of Year 5s. Who is Mr Docking? Mr Docking is the big boss. Really? Yeah, he is in charge of Northwest Academies Trust and all of the schools that are in the trust. Do you have anything to say to Steve directly? Can I have a pay rise? Part of the trust. Account. No, no, we can't plug thank just you, Mr. ourselves. Docking. After three, thank you, Mr. Docking. Okay. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs>